Morning nerd fighters. it's Saturday, November the 7th, and today I'm going to attempt to talk to you about originality. Ah, oh, the nerd fighters! Of course, the problem I'm coming up against is that after a week of great videos from everybody else about originality, I'm wondering whether there's anything original left for me to say. Stick with what you know is what they usually say, so I think I'm going to have to relate this to computer programming. When you have a problem or task to solve a computer, there are two ways you can attack that problem. You can start from scratch and go from first principles, or you can look around for other people who have had similar or the same problems and see what they did. Now, of course, working from first principles is useful sometimes, usually in a learning or academic setting when you're still trying to get to grips with how programming works. But when it comes to the real world, it's the second method that is generally preferred. Don't reinvent the wheel is the saying, of course. So you take a little bit of code from one person, another little bit of code from someone else, you mush them together with a little bit of your own code and out comes your final product. But is that original? Kind of, but also not. But does it really matter? And the answer is, I don't think so. It's the building and iteration on previous works that gives us progress. If everyone was starting from first principles all the time, we simply wouldn't have the time to get any significant advancements. And that's true for everything from science through storytelling, not just computer programming. We take what others have done before, we build and we improve, and whether it's original or not is not really relevant. And that's how we as a community or a species grow and evolve. Of course, even saying that, that still doesn't stop the feeling you get sometimes times of, why am I doing this? It's been done before. I certainly get that feeling plenty of times. But really, that's just your own brain's need for validation. If you make something, and then there's someone else out there who finds it interesting, useful, or worthwhile, then it's served its purpose. It doesn't matter if there are other same or similar things out there. So I think that's about it when it comes to my thoughts on originality. Thank you for watching, and Pat, I will see you on Monday.